What is up there guys, it's Proxy Thousand here. We're back with some more Bomberman Land Touch 2 for Nintendo DS. So last off, we did two zone boss against Jack and Queen. And today we're gonna continue on with the Sunny Tower. So yeah, last time we got rid of the gold team. We're walking away with Star Bomber Star Bomb Star Bombers. Really tiny magic. Alright. So, Bookworm Green is actually challenging us to a duel of memory in the Star Tower. I mean, Star Palace, sorry. I forgot his name is supposed to be Palace. Alright, do the Star Palace. He's, he's actually right here. Go up here, and he's right over there. Right at the choosing your gem thing. No one beats me in the Battle of Wits. Let's see what you've got. So before I start this video guys, rush that like and subscribe, ring the bell button to get notified of my coming videos. Leave it in the comments below. What is the most difficult attraction that you ever played so far? So where'd you go? Now you can only make three mistakes this time. And basically what you want to do is try to get the most valuable gem as possible. Red is valuable than blue, but the most valuable is actually the white, like that. I'm gonna target the most valuable one. See how many points do I have? Like, red contains 200. So blue only get you only gain 100 in blues. Red contains like 200 points, and white you get 300. That's pretty good. So what you do? What you want to do is just basically target the valuable one. And note that. Bookworm Green is actually a smart cookie. Get that? He can guess wherever these gem or diamond, whatever it is. So you better focus and be as fast as possible before Green actually picks your choice. But don't worry, I'm actually the most. I'm actually pretty good at this kind of game. Like, even though I'm blinked, I can still go for the most valuable one because it's so easy. To me, this kind of game is super easy. But when it comes to getting faster, okay, that's gonna be a real problem if that happens. He did one more mistake to fail. Let me try and not fail, in, even once. As long as he doesn't choose first, I'm fine. <coughs> All right, all right. Staying low key on my voice. Uh, okay. Yep. Perfect score without even failing once. He made three mistakes. Awesome. I did not even make the mistake once. Hmm. I lost. It looks like I still need to practice. Give me that star piece. I kind of forgot what's the maximum piece are. Is it still 25? I don't know. Like, is it 25 or 30? Or 40 ish? I uh, forgot. Like 5, 10, 15, 20. I kind of forgot a little bit about it. I don't know. I digressed. There, there's supposed to be one thing that I have to do. Oh no. Oh no. Not this zone. Like, seriously. You're not if you're not prepared for this next zone, might as well train a little bit. Like I'm real scared of this zone actually. I do not digress it. Uh, speaking of digress, I should have I should have find goal by now. Like he's already he left the tower already. Where is he? Where is goal? No, you're black. You're not my target. Like, where is gold anyway? I need gold. My giant gold. I'm calling for you. Uh, did I did this actually? Um, uh, let me check. I think I did this actually last episode, like many episodes ago, like. Second or third episode? Yeah, I did this. 
I think I did do one of them from the sky, the one with the sage. I have to go back and check. Give me a second. Do the sage. Oh yeah, get blue. And please... Inflate me. I need to go to the sky. How did Aqua manage to come here? The sage is so nice, I come to talk to him when I make a mistake in my training. Or whatever I have problem. Okay, I'm not sure if that's supposed to be safe or what. I already got that treasure chest, so screw that. Screw that. And what's the next thing that I have to do on my list? Oh yeah, find gold. Where is he? I got rid of him from Sunny Tower. Like, what am I supposed to do next? Like, where am I supposed to find gold to get rid of that ball? And yeah, he's not in here. Self-explanatory. Is he supposed to be in this star palace? The right, the second floor, on the right section? Uh, ow. Ow. Let me check. I don't know. My brain is just gone, so. No, it's too pink. My brain is not working right now. I think it's supposed to be in the, uh... Uh, where again? The Star Zone Beach? Uh, um, please. You're not here. Where are you? I'm calling Jungle. Uh, please don't tell me. If I have to go to that one zone, this zone right here, I'll check back later. Like a little piece, don't tell me that zone. Um, Sunny Zone? Excuse me? Like, where are you gold? I'm calling Giant Gold. The rain is getting harder and I hate that sound. Where are you, sucker? Screw it, I give up. I'll find Giant Gold later. And ladies and gentlemen, Prepare to experience Nightmare. You're about to enter the Earth Zone. Now, Earth Zone has two, two different sections. This is the Graveyard section. And who is this? You have done well. I am Ninja Bumble, the best ninja, the best ninja in all of Assassin's Creed. Your training shall now begin. Your task. Is to find where in the kingdom I am hiding again. Oh, you're seeing Shadow from Jutsu. Okay, what do you want? Can you find us ninjas? We three ninjas are hiding in this kingdom. Find us. And you shall be rewarded. Thank you. Like, I do not want to deal with this zone. Oh, yeah, speaking of green. Uh, hello? Where's your leader? Like, where is your leader? Uh, where are you? First one's pretty easy. They're three ninjas. So, well, it's actually pretty easy. You just gotta use this rod. What are those bubbles on the surface of the river? Maybe if I were to fish it out, whatever's hiding there. Just fish this and lift it up. Hey, I've been caught. It's basically a ninja bomber. Yes, rare is the one who can see through the ninja art of water escape. But your training is not over yet. There are still two more you must find. Good luck. And he's gone. Now this, the other two ninjas. So what you're going to do next is go to Star Zone. This is the warp just to get closer. And while doing that, I'll try and find giant gold as possible. Like, where are you? Like, you please give me a hint, where are you? Like, literally, where? 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 
Oh, come on. What is this? What is this? A big hump on the floor. That's strange. The sand is here is piled up. If I could sweep it away, maybe I could see what's underneath. I, I never expected you would sweep away sand. Me neither. You usually dig. And it's Ninja Bomber again. Yes, you have the talent to see through my sand camouflage technique. But you're not through yet. But still find out where the last of us hiding. Last one is actually pretty much in Sunny Zone. Finding the last ninja is in Sunny Zone, which you have to go to Sunny Zone basically. And uh, yeah, and I forgot to do this one first. Give me a second, ninja. And of course you're here. You know what? My fault. What is it? You want to ask me something? Yes. Want me to roll those big balls in the circus tent? Circus tent? <laughs> it's okay. Let's meet up in front of the circus tent in the blue zone. Then don't make me wait. Whatever. There's a basketball hoop way up there. If I throw something like a basketball here, something might happen. Even though you have a basketball, but it's too high for me. Too high for me. If I could get someone who's good at sport to help. Just like Kid Blue. I found Kid Blue before in the s s not sunny zone. Ah, moon zone. Now, oh, pay attention. Remember last time that there was only five trees. This was not here. Now, that's odd. I don't remember a tree when it, the tree here when I came before. This has never been here. Shake it. it. You don't have to shake me so hard. Shake it again. Make it harder. And it was him. Yes. How did you know I was so sure my morphing technique was infallible? Yes. I am most impressed. You, I, to you, I shall entrust Assassin Bill Price here, love. Said to open the Assassin's Trial. I hope to. I hope it sh shall serve you well in your quest. And now, I must bid thee farewell. And we got a shuriken. A throwing star, but it's so big and heavy. I wonder what it could be used for. Well, you got a giant shuriken. I'll take it. So, yeah. So, what I want to do next is find Kid Blue who has the. Help me with sports. Uh, I found him in Moon Zone, but I want to check this zone first. Nope, he's not here. It might be possible he's in the beach. What do you want? I love sports. Yeah, I know. But where are you, man? I'm trying to find, trying to find you, bruh. No, you're not him. If I'll talk to you later. See you, bruh. Alright, so to find Kid Blue, one must see above the moon. I mean below the moon. Just go to the moon zone. And he's right over there. What's wrong? I wanna go to the hoop. But first, uh sure enough, took me so long. Haha, <laughs> funny. So I wanna get three. Nice. Just make sure that tap on tap when the number's on three, and you're good. So, what this ball? Haha! <laughs> no sweat. I'll use my superpower to roll it in right away. Push! Wow, powerful. Even though the ball is probably made out of rubber, this is basically easy for anybody to push that. Helping people in trouble is all part of my duty as a leader. Ask me anytime. Sure thing. Probably never. And I gotta move peace. Give me a moment, please. I gotta blow my nose. Sorry if you can hear this. I hate rain. Oh. Like, I already hate rain because it gives me the cold. Ugh! 
like uh, today is not my day like February is not actually not my day like of course you already know like the new Animal Crossing game coming on switch Animal Crossing New Horizon well that is not my season for today like February raining in Indonesia if not then not only Indonesia tell me about your weather in your own country like US and China or Japan or whatever the case is anywhere other than Indonesia is it raining and are you having the most sickest day right now because I am too sunny zone too fine blue and blue's pretty much here so again let's hurry up to the hoop hoop to do now once you're here there's gold again Sounds good. I'll help you out. Let's do a killer super jump. And dong. Nice. Yeah, perfect. How do you how do you like my assist? You and me could take on take on the world, man. That was man. That was sh sure. I was about to say sure. What? I said it. That was so fun. See la. See you later. Whatever. Bye. And for a sunny zone, sunny peace. Ah, what's wrong with me? I mixed up my words. I have too many Japanese course this this year. I have a Japanese score that is mixing up my grammar on English. That's not good. Anyway, we cleared those, and yeah, pretty much cleared every single one of these zones except for the sunny tower. So now I'm gonna finish off this zone first and count them up. And the rain is getting harder outside, so sorry if you can hear that. So it's kind of up. There's like how many mini, mini bombers? It depends on like how depends on the type of mini bomber that they have here. And it's pretty easy. White bombers, one, two, three, four, five. Five, five mini bombers. I have to do it nine times. Still five. White. Uh, five, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's pretty easy. This is counting. Sometimes it gets difficult like this. No, we're not seeing this. You only need to do blue bomber. White, one. And there's only one mini bomber that is called white. Like, that's definitely the easiest. And this is one. And how many seconds did I even spare? Not even. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Uh, 7? 2, 4, 6, 8. Uh, 2, 4, 6, 7. And that took a long time. That before, I didn't like to waste any. Like, just one second? Ah, crap. One. Just one second. Yellow plus white. Oh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And we're done. Math game is just too easy, but when it comes to like, like mini bombers, you're gonna have to wear glasses if you are really blind. <laughs> it's out of sorts. Basically, you just gotta sort by colors. Sort out the mini bomber colors. Like, yeah, dragon bolt, dragon, one of these little cuties. Pretty easy. Not really entirely hard, but once you like it gets faster and harder after this, and mistakes will be made soon enough. Almost. Oh, that red bummer is moving fast. Oh god. I just don't not want to make a single mistake. Alright, moving too fast, I cannot catch you. Oh god. And we're done. Something I, you want to like go for the same color as possible, like to make it easier for you to sort out. Can this rain please stop outside here? It's just getting worse. I gotta shut up. This is the third floor, sorry. Anyway, to the second floor because I want to do it in order. How many minutes have I wasted? 19 minutes. I can just keep going. Now, this is where Magnet Bomb. Come and work. Basically, remember the remember the mechanism of moving these platforms is the same thing, but there's a trick to it. 
like this, see? I place the blue here. Now, this is red and this is blue. Oh, red, sorry. I repel. Let's say this is basic magnet. Like, this is science. This is literally science. Like, what is this? Rit Riddle. Another easy game. Kinda easy. This has got a map. Make sure that you know the pictures. Oh god. Before time runs out. Oh. Okay. Okay. Alright, that was pretty easy. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I have 600 points and it's not not that easy for 600 points like it depends on your time like that oh it's too easy yeah that was too easy oh god what is this oh god oh. yep oh boy what is this a little bit more one more I think I oh, think it 600? Yeah, I don't want to do this. It's easy, but at the same time, you could potentially make mistakes. A lot. If you're not accurate with the shapes. And that's one attraction down. And that's three, actually. Now move this. And put this here. This is technically the same thing as the other one. Remove this. And put the magnet here. And with that, we have our fourth attraction. This is Humpty Bomber. Now, this is actually not my favorite, but I kind of liked it. Humpty Bomber, memorize the model that appears for a second. Basically, you have to memorize again. Oh. I'm not gonna like this. I'm not sure if I'm doing precise, but forgive me if I'm not precise. Oh god. I'm just gonna screw it. I'm just gonna screw myself up. For sure. I've got... Oh, I don't know anymore. Oh god. Only my head and my hand are not bad, but my feet are just... destroyed. And 31 is not too great. I need 60. Ah, uh, not so bad. I'll put you here. Put you up here. Bomb should be here. Uh, I'm not sure if this is supposed to be. Yeah, this is the right. I'm gonna walk the statues now. Close. Getting close. The feed was good. The feed was 10. Sure. That was good. 41. Never doing this again. But this is actually kind of fun. But at the same time, I don't like it as well. Anyway, we cleared that attraction. Ow, my hands. Alright, moving down. And up to the third floor. Darn it, go base. Alright. Boing. We got the tower stamp, so we don't need to bother with that. Now for the nerf wrecking experience. Bowser Boom is back. Again. Ugh. I really hate this so much. Like, you have to at least get... Survive for 60 seconds. Oh my god. Like, this is one of the games that I really hate the most. Oh god, oh god. Oh 
Okay, we're doing pretty good so far. 30 seconds left. I mean, 25 seconds left. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. I'm starting to tremble. My hand is starting to cramp. Oh, 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 oh. Why do I even sign up for this kind of attraction? Alright, we survived for 60 seconds. That's pretty good. <coughs> Next up, Bomb Factory. Bomb Factory is back. Yes, I know. I hate this. Bomb Factory is back. But this time, this Bomb Factory is actually the normal, but in the first game, this is actually the Super Bomb Factory. They count this as normal Bomb Factory. See, that usually the normal don't have the pink. But this is normal, and they already have the pin right off the bat. And this is not gonna be good for me, because I hate Bomb Factory. But it's actually pretty easy once you get used to it. But still, not my favorite attraction. I guess you can screw up a lot in this kind of attraction. Okay, I got a 50 bombs to put. I'm not sure if that's the correct correct number of bombs that I need to put in. 50 bombs, I think? Yeah, I think like one bomb costs us like 10 points. Like, yeah, 50 bombs. We get 500 points. Oh, God. But you know what? I love this series, the Bomberman Land Touch series. I just wish... I just wish that Switch made a Bomberman Land series in this part of Switch. I'll absolutely buy that crap and I will enjoy it so much. Like, that should be a good idea. Like, they should make a Bomberman Land game for the Switch. I would agree on that so big. So big that 100% people will buy... Probably a lot of people. Because people also like this Bomberman Land Touch series. Like, Bomberman Land Touch series for the DS was actually a good one. And what's next? For Bomberman Land... Bomberman Land Portable? That's actually really good. Bomberman Land 3? Uh, I forgot 3. What was that? A Wii? Uh, Bomberman Land from the PS2 Japanese version? I played that. Oh my god, the Japanese was kind of hard because of the language barrier. But I absolutely enjoy that crap so much. Like, you don't even understand. Of course, you want a showdown. And I still have some time. I'll kill ya. I'll kill some time. But yeah, Switch... Switch already has Super Bomberman R? That's pretty good. Eh, what do you want? Super Bomberman R is already good. They just need to make a... Like, a Super Bomberman Land, if you want to name it in a Switch. That would be really great. Like, attractions? Maybe some attractions for the DS and PSP version? You can just make a collection. Collection bundle in one game. Honestly, people also like that kinda. Kinda like that. For sure thing. People will want a Bomberman Land game. I mean, not like uh, the original Bomberman game series, like to just escape bombs and fight monsters like that. Yeah, sometimes that's good. But you want like attraction for like Bomberman Land games? That's pretty good. Glad you come. Glad you could come. The time has finally come to see who's the real champ. It's Mono and Mono. It's showtime. Okay, the rain is starting to get lessened up a little bit. Time to beat Ace. Now, Ace is actually has more HP than the rest of the other zone boss, and his shots are way powerful. And what's next? That now they're gonna show us these spike bombs. Spike bombs are technically heavier bombs. Oh god. Like, spike bombs are technically heavy, but not for Ace. Even though you're really dragging the spike bomb really hard, it's it's gonna make it slow for you. Like, see, I'm... See, I'm... See, I'm really swiping it up real quick, and I still... It's still not... It's still, like, weak. Weak shot for that. And he spins like that and just scatter the bombs around you. 
Please explore, please. Thank you. Two more. Come on. Die, please. One more. Spike Bob. See, even though I'm throwing a powerful, he's more powerful than I am. And he's throwing his Spike Bob like it, it was a cheap bomb. Like that was a cheap shot. Outstanding. What power. What a technique. You truly deserve this title. The title. Here, this proof your champ. Thank you for the rainbow piece. Alright, we got the rainbow piece. What's next? And it's giant gold. Blue reflex blue reflexes are incredible. Check it out at the sunny zone attraction. Alright, let's see what you got. Uh what what's the other one first? Sunny Tower. Yeah, I gotta deal with pink. How to find Pink and challenge her? Basically, you want to go over here. He, she's right over there by the um, this game. This is actually my favorite attraction. I'm going to beat you, silly, and be, feel really good afterwards. What is your problem, girl? So she's gonna challenge us in Humpty Bomb like we did before? Uh, she's pretty good, actually. And the first one is Cupid herself. I'm just not so sure. This is the part I'm afraid. The feet are the most annoying. Like, the feet is actually like straight like that. Hey, I'm not bad. That's actually not that bad. It's kind of good. Boy, three, I'll take it. Hers? Not so much. Yeah, 39. Mine was pretty good, actually. I was doing real great. Okay. Oh, green. Oh, man. Ah, uh, this is actually kind of short. Wait, 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 whoa! Uh, I kind of forgot. You like this or something like that? I'm just gonna screw it. I don't know what else to choose. Ah, come on. The, the left, the right hand was right, but the left bomb was not too good. I got a 40, that's pretty good. Good thing that this game only takes two tries, and she got a 10. And she still lost to me. <coughs> we only need two tries to beat her. For example, if it's like three tries, that would be nerve wracking. No, ah, uh, now I'm even more stressed out. You, you're so cruel. Don't blame me for that. Did you give me a heart like that? Eh. Anyway, going down. 33 minutes. Whew. Wasted too many hours of playing this. Of course, you're there. That means that. You're here to challenge me, do ya? Come on, let's hop. Can you keep up with the speed and techniques of the team go? Yes, I can. Pogo jumper. They're pretty good. If you don't, if you're not careful enough, they might bump into you. Bumping is a thing in this kind of thing, actually. Make sure that you don't hit anything, not even the bombs. I'm my bad. Yep, that's good. Oh no, green is. See ya! Sucks to be gold! Haha! <laughs> 1950, oh god. You're such. Uh, Lou always pushes his luck, it's frustrating. But here, pieces of three people. And with that, we have 20 pieces of Star, Moon, and Sunny! What do you want? What's wrong? A circus girl was moping around the beach in Sunny Sunny Zone. Maybe her fat ringleader yelled at her? Don't call Queen. You better not call Queen fat in front of her. She could kill you, bruh. What's wrong, Aqua? 
It's so rusty. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Queen? I mean, Aqua? What can I do? He stole the Queen's hat. Hey, it's Aqua. She looks really down. I wonder what happened. Huh? Who's there? Oh, it's you. You surprised me. Well, I was bringing the Queen her hat. All of a sudden, a guy in a suit came out of nowhere and took it. He ran away laughing like a madman. How can I ever, how can I ever tell the queen that I got her stolen, I got her hat stolen? I'm such a doofus. Okay, I gotta punish this person for grand theft. I am the thief bomber. Hello, I am elusive master thief. Try to catch me if you can. That's it. For punishing this girl, which is supposed to be my love, not my love, but white love. Punishing Aqua like that, you're going too far. That's it. I'm gonna find you and knock your butt out of your pants. Whatever the name, whatever that is. How to find the bomber and get the hat back? First of all, you need to get this open. And what is this? A, a fuse? That's lure him. Not bad, kiddo. I'll, it'll take more than just finding me to catch me. How does he have that? Haha, <laughs> see you around, kiddo. He floated away with those balloons. I gotta, I gotta find him and get Aqua's hat. You can't catch me. That last time was a fluke. You won't be able to find me this time. Oh, really? And your recipe should be right. Um, oh, you're not here? Uh, speaking of stamp. Yeah, I got a clip already. A clip. There we go. Where are you? When I get my hands on you, you're so, so, so dead, son. I'm talking about my girl, Aqua. Like, nobody messes with her. So, last spot that you're gonna be, right over here. Now, looks like some... Ah. Get down here with that hat. Whoa, 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 cut that out! Oops, I was supposed to, supposed to talk. Just as I suspect there's someone hiding up there. I better shake a little harder. Shake as hard as you want. Get down here. Ow, 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 ouch! Where am I? What am I doing here? Hey, this isn't my hat. It's just your kiddo? I see. I don't remember anything after meeting the girl on the beach. As if I was dreaming. I'm sorry, really. You've gotta believe me. Here, I'll give you this hat, kiddo. Okay, I got the queen's hat. I got the cowboy hat. Like, this is the kind of hat that the queen like. And now I must bid you adieu. I must bid you adieu. Tell that girl I'm sorry when you see her. Sounds like he's just feeding amnesia to me. Well, I better hurry up. I better hurry and give this hat to Aqua. Like, amnesia is probably the most annoying kind of like sickness that you kind of experience. Um, uh, yeah, not gonna believe him. Ah, that hat you've got there. It's the queen's favorite hat. So. You got the stolen hat back for me? Well, I'm so surprised. Thanks to you, it looks like I won't, I won't have to get yelled by Queen. Thanks for the love. Our base. I better take this hat over to the Queen right away. See you later. I gave Aqua the cowboy hat so I can't use it anymore, but she seems happy, so I guess I did a good deed. Alright. Shall we dance? Time to get... Time to get down and see who's better dancer at Sunny Zone. Okay. Do I still have any time? Not really. Do that. See? This cowboy hat is cannot use. Oh, I don't know why I keep on doing that. Anyway, I'm gonna do this last one, so I gotta make sure I be prepared. How did you manage to get this so fast, Apple? You just went back from Moon Zone already? Okay, sure. No late. You got some nerve to keep two girls waiting. When I say come, I mean now. Pink's rowling on, on like always. Wait, 
did she say two girls? Hey, Aqua's here too. Hi, Kipping invi Hiya, Kipping invited me to come dancing. I'm not very good, but I'll try my best. Any chit chat, let's get started. Be honored you'll be able to see our amazing moves. Oh sure, my two girls. Nah, music games are my thing. You two ladies don't stand a chance. I'm gonna shut up. Stylus drop. Wow, around three thousand. I'm um, I'm like around five thousand. Like, I was so easy. No way. Do you mean to say I can't keep up with you? Ha! Huh, that's absurd. I simply refuse to believe it. Ah, here, take it. It's a key I found. The only reason I'm giving you it is because I don't need it. Cupid, please wait. Uh oh, she stormed off with a fury. You really are a good dancer though. Kim Ping just feels embarrassed she's not as good. Wow, really? I kinda agree. She'll be fine. Thank you, Aqua. I know the reason she gave me the key is because she realizes I really have her skills. That's right. And we got the Korean key to a specific zone, actually. I got a forest key. And this is the only time that this is one. This actually. Um, uh, you know what, let me just show you. Do I have enough time for this? I sure hope so, like... Okay, I gotta make this quick. 40 minutes has passed. Okay, whatever you want, just make it quick, please. I'm sorry, yeah, whatever. There's a strange sage. Alright, oh, sure. So why do you need this green key? It's for this. This is, a. Um, S uh, second section of the Earth Zone. I'm gonna do that next episode. So, thank you so much for watching, guys. Rush that love and subscribe, ring the bell button, get notified when I come videos. Leave in the comments below. What is your favorite attraction and rival battle in this uh, for now? So, thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you all next time on Bomberland Land Touch 2 or the DS. So, boom, shakala. Bye.